My name is Deborah Jo Elvers. I go by DJ. I'm a licensed vocational nurse with Maxim Home Health. I've been with Jackson for four and a half years. When Jackson came from the hospital, he had been there for 10 months. He had oxygen, a trach, a ventilator, G-tube. He was very sick. I was actually here the day that he came home from the hospital. It was the first time he'd ever come out of that building. The very first day when we came home from the hospital, she wanted to be here to meet us and go over everything about Jackson. That says a lot about a nurse and a person she is. As a new mom bringing my son home, that was very reassuring. Jackson has struggled ever since he first came home from the hospital to get well enough to just be a playful little boy. When he was younger, he would watch the kids playing basketball in the cul-de-sac, riding their bikes, riding their scooters. We sat at that window for two years while he was on the ventilator and watched the other children outside playing. And he would play inside and he was always in good spirits, but you know, you could tell that he's watching the other children outside. And now he can do all of it with them run around just like all the other kids. It is such a joy to watch him play with the other children and not be attached to anything. When I first heard about the Caregiver of the Year Award, my first thought was DJ. Um, her journey with Jackson and with Maxim has been something that I felt needed to be shared on not only a local level, but a national level. Um, what she's been able to do with this patient has been Un unbelievable. When Matt called me and told me that he wanted to nominate DJ, I was so excited for her because she deserves it so much. It's really cool for them to be able to see the hard work that she does. And I remember when I was told that I'd won, the first thing that I said was, oh my gosh, I feel so appreciated. The award says a lot about Maxim. It tells me that Maxim really cares that their caregivers give the best care possible. In a few months when Jackson has his G-tube taken out, you know, DJ is gonna be the last nurse here. She's gonna do the very last shift, you know, and, and for DJ to, to come onto a case, be the first nurse in, take care of Jackson this entire time, and be the last nurse out on the last shift after Jackson no longer needs our services, it, it, it absolutely amazes me. Working for Maxim, with this family has been the absolute best four and a half years of my life.